morning guys yeah still more than just my hair is a bit crazy um i have to tidy my shed i have to do it uh i the, the petrol blower wasn't working properly yesterday um it sounds like the cup's blocked up but i'm in need of it tomorrow and the generator also needs service the generation needed service i want to say roughly i think i said in one of those like 20 hours 20 or 30 hours probably ago it's been run up a, a lot <clears throat> and you should you should do its first oil change after 15 hours I think it is on any machinery I think honestly well it is on the Nielsen ones anyway but I, I did buy the proper oil and stuff for the um for that one they recommend uh, 1030 which you can't buy in the shops or not that I've seen of you cannot I've looked in all service stations don't be set in there my way of them don't do them there what they sell is like the 1040 or the 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 or they sell the um, 540 or 530 that's not what I need I need the 1030 I need the one that's all in between um, I don't know, I'm going to run up I'm going to run the blower up and um, I think I'll give that another oil change as well something was not right with it oh my god if any of you know how far two yards is about two, three yards so my sat truck decided to have a blowout um, without even touching it basically I didn't even know it blew out went to start packing stuff up and I couldn't use it because I had a flat tire so um, I ended up having to carry four sandbags it doesn't sound like a lot but two yards bear in mind this is, it's not on flat surface I had to carry a petrol blower uh, generator, I know it's got wheels, but the wheels are, are crap. Uh, two bounce castles. Thankfully, I didn't have to carry all of that. I was able to put the small one on my back, I was able to carry the heavier one a quarter way down. Um, and guys from the other place, school where I was yesterday, um, <coughs> helped the rest. Um, I, I literally have to get it in for service. Uh, this Jenny it's definitely going to need service as well because it sh should not have been run up for as long as it has. So the first thing we're doing is, I'm probably not going to video it, but I'm going to clean this damn shed because I need to get in there and I need to get to the workbench at the, at the, at the back. It's, it's a must need. Luckily I've got power back there now, so you know, power is no issue. Thankfully, it's just it's coming at the wrong time, guys. It's coming at the wrong time. If it was going to break down, it could start breaking down at you know when I didn't need it for ages. But no, it starts to break down um, when I need it. I could hear it when I got on the bounce castle. Um, I could hear it a little bit, but I wasn't sure if it was just because kids were jumping around. On it. But when I got onto the bounce castle. Um, You can feel it hiccup a little bit anyway, you know, you feel it, but it wasn't, it was bouncing up and down. And you could hear it going, rum, rum, rum. To me, that sounds like the car was blocked up. Um, it didn't, it doesn't normally do that. Even when I turn it, it right down low, uh, to empty the, uh, get all the fuel out of the carb, uh, it would cut out. I literally have to put the choke fully on and move it, n n I'm not lying here, move it about 2 mil or 3 mil off the choke for it to stay running. Just. Someone's not right there, guys, so that's going to need to be looked at and stuff. So, we're going to be frying some spiders today because I'm sick and tired of the webs. Uh, fingers crossed it stays dry because my shed leaks, which is nice. 
and then um, yeah, we'll go from there because what else can I do? I've also got two kids to look after as well. <laughs> so. Sorry guys, oh my. Someone's on our printer. Someone better not be using our printer. Because I'm savage for that. But yeah, I've got the smaller one of this outside. Um, I'll probably just keep filling that one up and I'm pouring it in. It's easy to use and stuff, so. See you later, guys. Yes, guys, the shed is slowly getting there. Slowly, that shelf in there, I'm just going to take it out because it's just useless. It's warped on me and everything. I haven't used it yet, so I'm just going to take it out. Um, well, I've got power to these. I've basically thrown a cable up into that. So I've also got power here and that, and I've got power here as well. Um, yeah, mm -hmm. just plugged in over there. Um, I'm gonna move the car over now and I'm gonna bring the blower and the Jenny around and go start running them up. I'll just have to quickly move this out of the way. Oh, I'll take it real to do stuff. So, There's so much stuff to get rid of. So much stuff. Oh, it's looking. Clouds are on and off at a really dark spawn. Um, so, yeah, I'll bring that around and we'll go from there. No, my, no, my luck, guys. Sorry, didn't look as we're going then. Um, it's probably not going to do it, but it definitely was. So, start up.
sure it's in the video now, but I'll turn that, I'll just turn the road right down. What's that? That's the choke pretty much all the way on and to keep it stable at that. So that basically means to me that carbon is being now. That there, as you can see, needs to be fully left. Choke to be on. It's be fully right for the to be off. So, I do it all the time this my guys. It's probably kind of the end time thing forever to do this. Um, I'm gonna tidy up all this. Um, I'm probably gonna have dinner and drink all that kind of thing. Same time, so I don't know. I don't know. But you can watch if you want. They're gonna be interesting because I'm just gonna move the stuff out of the way. I'm just gonna move your stuff to one side to another just so I can get to where I need to get.
noise or that noise. Um, right. Don't think we've got ten mil in here. No, right, I'll be back. Right, got my ten mil. Um, I've also brought my other blow gun in. Um, I don't know when this was the last time, to be honest. I don't know why it's playing up like it is, but I mean, the oil doesn't even need doing. But I'm going to do it anyway. It's honestly not too bad. I expected it to be a little black, but it's honestly not that bad. Alright. I'll check the air filter one night. I'm just going to turn the compressor back on for me, guys, so I need to build some air back up.
so I'll leave that to it up for a minute. Um, I'll go and have some dinner. It's like half eleven now, so I'll go and have an early dinner. Keep my kids happy as well. And plug this back up, put it all back in, and then um, I'll switch it around and have a look at the carb. Frustrate me. See him. See him when we get back. Hi guys, I'm back. I bet you cannot guess what we had for dinner. But you can't guess. But you can't guess. You are absolutely spot on. Yeah, I had, I had more toast. Um, I left. Oh, I don't want that one. I left the brake cleaner inside. And I really cannot be bored to him. Um, really cannot be bored to go in and grab it. So, let's grab a new one in. I'll order some more at some point. I'll just give them a spray now. Because obviously we don't want them all messy now, do we? Just trying to make them all nice and clean here. Alright. Uh, as usual, it's probably going to be noisy because the compressor's more than likely going to kick in, so... It doesn't need to be very heavy duty, Jesus. It just needs to be a little hook. Just something like, I don't know. Bring something a bit more, maybe. This is a long process. It will take a fair while. 
And then um, we'll also take a look at the carb as well, like I said, because something's not right there. I need to get my service sheet ready. I'm going to grab that one up. So, of course, I have a maintenance sheet for the um, petrol blower. Just not the gelling yet. So, that's another thing that needs to be um, brought up. So whilst it's filling up, I can get on to this checklist short and quickly. Knew where I put my bloody pen that was. Cone, check the cone. A bit scratched up, that's okay. Change, yes. Air filter change. No. No. Need. I'll do. Rubber feet, let's check. Fuel filter change. No. Don't have one. Cleaned fur fins. No, not run enough. Fan test. Well, that would be the true thing afterwards, isn't it? So. I don't know what to do because I'm already getting decent oil, um, decent fuel, so I don't know what else to do. I'm hoping it's not that. I said this holds now. I don't know if it's a fair bit. I should take all of this. I'll write oil in place of. Um, can say ten thirty we will need. So yes, I had lovely toast for um, dinner, breakfast, dinner, lunchtime, whichever one it is. That's not this one. Oh, God. 
Right, he's not going to fit him back up. Oh, come on. Then we didn't see things. Jenny takes one liter, I want to say. Of course, it's getting caked in it. Because, you know, why not? Oh, this is a different color. This is a different colour. Oh wow. So what's recommended for it, so I'm just gonna dry on. That's it. I'm about to start your fur. You can just see that there. You can see the drip. You can see the drip. So therefore that means now that's that's um it. Let's try and move you down to my level actually. I'll be a bit better for you. Yeah, it didn't cut it well. I don't know. So that's that. I'll take that off. I'll try to come to there. Grab this. This is on flat, flat surface anyway. So screw it up. Unscrew it, and you'll see it's fill up. So, let's put them. Oh, I was going to make a more draw on that. And then the blood. That's what she said. So if that's what the rope's climbing on my neck. Sorry guys, you know, stand up here. Well, for the carb. Air uh, filters there, doesn't need them. Just cover for the crap, must be like that. Air filter. I'm hoping this is just in case when the carb is blocked, I really am. I need to get anything for it. Well, that's not going to happen now. Also, have a look 
the spark plug in there, I suppose, over here. Do you have the mask on this one? Oh. Don't mind I've seen this one. Uh huh. This looks like it's got a warranty thing on it. You know, where they colour it in and stuff. Which I don't know why. I don't know why they would have that on this, but, you know. Well, it flips it up over, I suppose. Please don't tell me that. Oh, I've seen that. There we go. So uh, the rubber gasket itself is that's metal on the outside, but the rubber gasket itself is actually okay. Now let's see what fuel we actually get out of there. The carb itself, the carb bowl itself, it's got, it's got a little, a little bit of um. Oh my god! I'm going to tell I've never seen this. I don't know if you can see that, but that is absolutely minging in the bottom of that. So, oh my god, man. No. This was clean. So that will explain everything, basically. Dude, I would disconnect you, but I can't play get you to disconnect you. Um, I don't want to be disconnected there because let's see if the float works actually. So the float works, as you can see, the fuel's on. If I release on the float now, um, fuel should start coming out, which it does. Oh, and it sounds like I've got air ambulance coming into land again. Jesus, that's, that's pretty tight on there. I wonder if I can just clean you in place. Just with the good blood go. And some car cleaning. All this carb cleaning stuff is so much nice. This carb cleaning stuff is actually um, it's actually working a treat. It's actually um, really good actually. Jets and stuff like that.
why the hell there's such a long bottom top on, never mind. Grab the spark plug socket, but um, not looking too bad. Hopefully, this fixes it. If it doesn't, I don't know what else to do. recommend using this to put this back up in place but considering I can't see it down the thing I can't move you off either I wonder if I move you off down Let's see if I know if it's worked or not. And yeah, the uh, the other plugs are on the other side, but personally, I would never use that. So. We're back in sack, so once I've got a spark plug socket, I'm going to um, check this out, see what the spark plug's looking like. Alright, back. Back again. Yes, I'm back. Tell a friend. something you want to see. And this stinks, so bring them over here. We'll zoom it in and see that on there. Side is not actually too bad itself, I guess. Oh, yeah, it's and the feeder gauges are the things that doesn't need that needed to do them, so bring it back over here, bring it back out. Obviously don't get wrenching it down because there's no need to be wrenching it down. Yeah, 
Photo Patron. Happy days. Maybe. The same days. I shall start filling up the bottom. So she brings us now. Alright. Fingers crossed. Please be fingers crossed.
system had a One thing is another enemy. One bit I'll show you that was loose. I'm almost certain there's something missing from that. I'm almost certain. So, I'm going to bring Jenny in. I'm going to give him an oil change. And then head to the manual for the uh, blower. I, I, do not need, I do not need to be there. I don't need be needing this right now. It's come at a very wrong, wrong time for me. Especially when I'm needing it tomorrow. I mean, I wouldn't even want to chance taking that out where that is. So, I'm just get space cleared up here somewhere for you guys. There's actually quite a bit of crap in that, so... Very annoyed. Very, 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 very annoyed. enough room. Awesome. Right. The bottom of this, I don't know if you can see the feet here, I'm going to tighten them up because they've broke. I'm going to destroy them from this path. You know, one on it. That's kind of the right yourself loose for me. Okay. 
But it looks like typically the oil comes out here, as typical as it gets, unfortunately. Definitely needs an oil change, that's for sure. Now I'm going to need to find something to go from there, down straight in. choice here guys please feel free to step in and stop this sliding anywhere oh come on what's in the other socket there it is stay in the face oh what a place to freaking I tell you what I do not how I do not understand the people that employ dogs so it's to stick these things are ridiculous places, you know what I mean? Oh, shoot. Yeah, that definitely, um... That was definitely need. You see metal particles and that, but as again, as per usual to be expected. Oh, come on, don't be going all over there, man. And that's going all over my work, work bench. Wow. Dickish thing, man. I'm completely fuffled. Oh, Jesus. I need something to hold this back, just in case this falls. Oh. 
I'm so hacked off, guys. I really, really need it to work. I'm not going to work my ass off to find out what the hell's wrong with it. I think something's definitely missing there. There's definitely something missing from that bit. But what? That's the question. On one of these wheels, the wheel bearing keeps freaking popping out. I need rubber nothing against the side. Just doing my head in. This whole machine just does my head in, but... You know, I say it's working fine now, so is the other one. The other one's working fine. I don't have no words, I just... I'm pissed off. And that, for and friends, is... spot on, I'd say. Because it's there, and it's literally just... Whoa, just popping up now. So, And just add a tap of more. But I need to work out the hours and all this thing. Because it's crazy amounts. I think that's it. You can see the levels in that room. Our kids, as usual, fighting. And you see them right up and up, so that's not done. I've not tried to run two blurs off this thing, nor should I try. So I'm gonna end up blowing the AVR or something. Oh, I don't know. This is Move this on a little bit more. I need to go grab a. Glass, but then <laughs> look at the size of it compared to just that one thing. I paid £420 for that other one. I paid £420 for that one. That one up there. And it's a little over a year old, I want to say. So this one's this was too. 225 or something like that. What makes it this thing isn't gonna be the same. It's a new it's a Nielsen still. It's saying it's a seven horsepower, yeah. On the side, but wrong labelling. Seven horsepower here, wrong labelling. Yeah, alright, dickheads. God hope you see this because you've got a bunch of excuse me, French wankers, but 
let's go in and investigate some more, I suppose. I suppose we better stick a label on this. On this other one. Um, what's the date today? The date is the 20th. Crap, we 24 already, man. Jesus. 20th of the 7th, 17, service by myself. Next service, I need to. Oh, sorry, guys, you cannot see that. It's just a um, service label. I need to um, look up when the next service will be. So. Right, your battery is just about dead anyway. Let's take you um, put it you on charge. Oh my god, this this whole thing is like covered. I'm sorry if you cannot see properly. Um, let's take you um, and um, charge her up. I'm trying to figure out what the hell's wrong with this thing. So, see you in a sec. <coughs> Guys, I have no idea. <sighs> I don't have no idea. This here does say it's meant to be connected to something. Please tell me if you think I'm wrong here. Am I correct or not? Um, it's still behaving like a little pig. So, I'm just going to end the video and stuff here. It's quarter three now in the afternoon and. I bet you any money you won't have time to finish rendering by the time it comes to the end of tonight. So therefore it's gonna be like oh my god, I'm too late. Computer's very have to be left on again all night. Is there any better for you guys? Next but that. If you know Please, please, please help me. Excuse me, folks. I'm, I'm in serious shit right now. So, thanks for watching, guys, and um, any help be much appreciated. Thanks.